following contest is a steel cage match. Making her way to the ring from Japan, the women's all-star champion, Man Nick Carl. As we look at the steel surround the ring, Corey, what are your thoughts heading in here? There is nothing more barbaric than this, Cole. It's like we have a couple of caged animals locked up inside that steel. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for our big steel cage match. And I know both of these superstars are supremely tough, but you'd have to assume they're experiencing some butterflies here as we wait for the opening bell. As we get underway, I'm expecting a hard-fought match between these two superstars. The first one to make a mistake could fail. You gotta believe this one's over. Oof. Boom, what impact. Ooh. Ooh, what impact. The rivalry between Ultimate Warrior and Ravishing Rick Rude began during the Super Pose Down at the 1989 Royal Rumble. Then it progressed to where both superstars battled over the Intercontinental Championship. At SummerSlam, she goes for the cover. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Yeah, this early, no chance. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. The WWE Championship match between the Ultimate Warrior and Ravishing Rick Rude was the second half of the double main event at 1990 SummerSlam. The rivalry between the Warrior and the Ravishing One was so heated that no one knew what to expect once the two men were able to battle inside a steel cage, which at the time was the most grueling match in all of WWE. The Ultimate Warrior dominated early on with his incredible strength. Rick Rude turned the tables and used the steel. She goes for the quick pin. She's looking to get out of here with a win early. Very nice. Before 2017's Extreme Rules, there were just three previous tag team matches where championship gold was decided inside a steel cage in the history of WWE special events. The Hardy Boys were in two of those matches. At Extreme Rules, in order to win the match, both members of a team had to exit the cage and have both feet on the floor. The Hardys used their famous continuity to gain the early advantage until Cesaro and Sheamus utilized their devastating power to slow the pace of the match down. Both teams battled atop the steel cage, but in the end, Sheamus and Cesaro won the race to the arena floor to become new Raw Tag Team Champions. Oh man, she is rolling now. Going for the big one. Bam, what a slam. It, is that it? Is it over? That She goes for the cover. This battle's not over yet. She's still in this one. Oh, nasty impact. And she turns it around on her.
Or a pump handle. Pump handle coming. Big time slam. Vicious. That's it. That's what she needs. She goes for the cover. This steel cage match is in the books. Now let's take another look at these wonderful women in action. Who could forget this? This was another great moment. And finally... Here is your winner, Maverick. Put it in the books. And there was no question about that one. Wow, I can't believe the amount of punishment that had to be inflicted in order for those shoulders to stay down.